Hey, what's up? I'm Karen Fian, and I'm here to answer the internet. Okay. Are there sacred days when you refuse to masturbate? No. <laughs> I love this. So let's say like it was like your friend's funeral. Right. Is there a bathroom? <laughs> like just what about in the morning? And like you're waking up and you're like, God, we got this long day ahead of us. You probably partied a little bit at the at the wake. Sounds like a perfect time to masturbate. Well, uh, I'm, I'm just waiting for that <laughs> happened to me, and I feel bad about it. So. <laughs> I'm like, I showed up to my uncle's wake in a crop top, so I was like ready. What about 9-11? Uh, you masturbate on 9-11? You know, I did not, but I did have sex. <laughs> so. You had sex on 9-11? Yeah, I just moved after? here. It, like you, like, like no. that night, right? It was like the after, it was the morning. Yeah. And so I was in college. I was a freshman. My whole like class went back home. Like they went back home to move home with their parents, and my mom called me before it even hit. Like my grandmother had come to her in a dream. Like my, I'm like a witch, but no, I just got hammered all day. I met these guys who lived in Astoria. I had no idea where Astoria was. I thought it was so glamorous. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like oh, Astoria. <laughs> Astoria, wow, great. And um, yeah, I had sex with this guy named Pat uh, who had back knee. <laughs> Oh my God, would you put your kid in a gorilla pit for 50 grand? Um, I'm barren, so <laughs> my kid in a gorilla pit, for how long? Is that a guess or is that witchcraft? For how, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I have three good eggs left. Um, I don't know, 50 grand? How long does he have to be in there? Can I train him? Can we lube him up? <laughs> can, we, can we like? Sure, Karen, can you lube him up? <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying if you put a slippery kid in a gorilla pit, he's gonna have a better shot. <laughs> I'm no, getting. Like you dip him in a fucking bowl of jelly, and we're good. I'm like, listen, Kyle, maybe if you weren't such an annoying little shit, mom would have put you in the grill a bit. Kyle. If you had to watch one category of porn for the rest of your life, what would it be? Hot girl gangbang. Mm, I feel like that's like every girl's answer. Yeah. At least every girl I hang out with. I yeah. was say, you think so? It's uh, most of the girls I hang out with. Uh, yeah. I feel like the traditional girl answer would just be lesbian porn. I hate lesbian porn. You're a dick. Exactly. You're so God. I'm into like really taboo stuff that's not good, like doctor porn, like where the girl's too young. I just don't oops, edit this. Um, <laughs> they're gonna come for me. <laughs> I love a hymen check. <laughs> you know, like a yeah. gangbang hymen check. That's like the good. That's no, a good. I don't know that. They'll have like joking. no, like they'll have the doctor come, like the doctor, and he like checks her hymen and like shows, make sure she still has a hymen, and then the guy that she's dating gets to break her hymen while his best friend walks. Watch it. Honest. Watches. It takes a lot to get me taken aback at my phone. You just did it. <laughs> Try it. I thought this was a joke. I didn't know it was real. But that's when they'll start, you'll start getting the messages on Try the it. internet. I don't think I will. Yeah, it's like, it's like, <laughs> I like an actual video of a teenager's first LBGYN. <laughs> <laughs> There's not even sex. It's <laughs> just a doctor. <laughs> but there is that. That's it. I like that stuff, though. All right, hey. Real kick shame here, except for that one. <laughs> Would you rather give up porn or sex for one year? Sex, because I can still come if I watch porn. <laughs> and it's something to do. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, the, the frequency, too, you know what I mean? Would you rather have your internet history made public <laughs> or a sex hate that goes viral? Um, what? Well, uh, I wouldn't mind having a sex hate go viral at all. You would make it. You would go... Hollywood if you had a sex tape to go to viral. I mean, I would write it. There would be a beginning, middle, and end. There would be heartbreak. There would be laughter. There would be, there'd be tears. There would be a real medical doctor. <laughs> yeah, I feel like that would be good for business. Yeah, I wouldn't mind that at all. That? Yeah, like, of course. Every time oh, I have no. sex, I'm like, where is the camera? <laughs> what are we doing here? My boyfriend's like pulling the shades down. I'm like, leave them up. And, and what, would, what, uh, what, would your, what would you be afraid about with your internet history going? My, my internet history is just gonna, yeah, it's, it's, there's, the word teen has just been written too many times. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That's yeah. <laughs> Sports and really everything in the world right now are different. Everything's a little off, but Labatt Blue Light is doing everything they can to make sure there's a, a degree of normalcy in your life. Even without fans in the crowd or without new shows on TV, they're doing what they can to help you hashtag gear up. Tonight's featured question from Labatt Blue Light, you could gear up with a million dollars or push a button that gives you a 50-50 shot at a hundred million, which are you taking? hundred million.
Okay, this sounds good. Two buttons, you can only press one. A, instantly get a million dollars. B, have a 50-50 chance you get 100 million dollars. I'm taking the mill. I'm not that risky. A mm. hundred million? Like a million, like you still gotta work. No, but I'm gonna flip that million. You don't even know. I'm gonna get. By doing what? I don't know. I'll jazzle my vagina with like millions of fucking diamonds. If you had a, see, that would be smart. I would take every single dollar. Yeah. And invest it in my pussy and be like, this is a literal million dollars. Literally. And then you can start an OnlyFans. <laughs> only million, but you can have only million dollar clientele. Yeah. It would be the ultimate million dollar listing, That's or you could it advertise it as a million dollar garage. It could be a parking spot. <laughs> you pay. You pay. Then you put it on Trulia. <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather be a pig? <laughs> what? Sorry. Would you rather be a... No, Whitney Waythor. Um, would you rather be a pig and be able to orgasm for 30 minutes or be a lion and be able to have sex 60 times a day? Yeah, I'd rather have sex 60 times a day. Oh, oh. boo. That poor pussy. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> 30 minutes, it's, it's too long. I feel like I, I like I sometimes bail on my own orgasms after like four minutes. I'm like, get me out of here. We're going to get in trouble. <laughs> do you ever, yeah, do, you ever, you ever do that? I don't know. Like, like, four, like it's a four-minute orgasm? Yeah, sometimes. I mean, that's, that's on its way to 30 minutes. It's a long fucking time, four minutes. I, I'm saying with our ropes and glory, we still yeah. have that. There's just something so about... I, mean, I, I, don't, I have never seen a girl... I've never made a girl come for more than 10 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> but like one of the slow NBA counts. One, <laughs> two... One Mississippi. Yeah, two yeah. Mississippi. Hardcore Mississippi. You know, four minutes? You've been coming for four minutes? Yeah. What does he do for the four minutes? Or is oh, this is with my vibrator. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is when I'm watching like old man, young girl. Um. <laughs> Santa ten times. Um, when you're drunk, is it better to get laid or have the ideal drunk meal? Um, I'm obviously uh, don't eat. Um, eating's for fat people, <laughs> so obviously have sex. <laughs> I don't even drink anymore, <laughs> but if you answer to eat a meal, I bet fucking H. Foley, I'll eat it. <laughs> oh, I'm hungry. <laughs> Been here for 45 minutes. You guys don't even have some charcuterie. <laughs> I love him. Would you fuck Kelly Ripa? No, bony bitch. Um, no. Would you fuck Kelly Ripa if it had to be a threesome with Regis? Regis would be the selling point for me. <laughs> I don't fucking want bony ass. I take bar classes. You, you are a bar. If you were reading the story of your life and you got to the present day, so it'd only be 21 years long, would you keep reading knowing you can't change anything you read? It's just a, that's a very wordy way to say, like, do you want to know the Yeah, it is. Right? Who the fucking Harry Potter this? faggot wrote this? <laughs> In the world of the future, would you like to see into the what? <laughs> it was right. <laughs> no. No. Like, do I want to know the future? No, I want to make it. <laughs> no, I do know the future. Who is the, wor who is the one person in the world you at least want to bang who you would, the least would you would want to bang your significant other? Like, like, wh what chick would I not want to bang my current boyfriend? <sighs> Fuck. Oh my god. Because this, would you rather like a, your your boyfriend cheat on you with an ugly chick or a hot chick? Um, that's a great question. Because if a guy cheats on you with like a six, that's a diss. Like yeah. that's mean. That's an insult to me and what I look like. If he cheats on you with a chick who's hotter than him or me, he's probably not going to get her. You know. So that's fine. Yes, she was like going like batting below. So no, the thing is, my boyfriend's a personal trainer. So if he all of a sudden, but like most of the chicks are like, you know, big, they need help, right? But here's the scary thing about that: if he falls in love with their personality and then they transform, right? Because I'm a cunt. <laughs> Nothing redeeming as far as personality it's is concerned. Just what you see is. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking high waisted pants all day. <laughs> Would you rather your boyfriend be able to read your thoughts during sex or all the time except during sex? Oh, you can definitely read them during sex. Go for it. Because I love fucking my boyfriend. My boyfriend's so hot. Nobody find him. <laughs> 
Would you rather A, throw up anytime? Yep. No. <laughs> Sorry, sorry, sorry. Would you rather, sorry, throw up anytime someone says McDonald's or B, wear a fedora for the rest of your life and if anybody asks you about it, you have to say, I like the way it looks. This is just Rich Voss's life. <laughs> this is just what he has to do. Um, yeah, I guess I'd wear the fedora though. I like the way it looks. Would you rather A, fuck in the same position for the rest of your life or B, only be able to jerk off to one porn video, I'd have to pick A because I can't even watch the same video twice and come to it. I know. Really? Yeah. I mean, there's a couple that I can go back to and be like, this will work again. But even then, sometimes it doesn't. I need new pussy every time. <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather be the best looking girl in the world or be able to read minds? Best looking girl because then you'd have all the money. <laughs> Read minds? What, I mean, if you're the best looking girl, you can just assume everybody's saying that girl's hot. So it's kind of like reading minds anyway. <laughs> They're not thinking, I bet she's smart. <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather A, be permanently hungover, or B, never be able to drink again? Well, I haven't had a drink in two and a half years. <laughs> Thank you, I'm a hero. Um, so I, yeah, uh, that's fine. It's, this isn't a fact. I don't ever want to drink again. Hung hangover suck. They're brutal. So you don't miss it? No. Uh, no, and my hangovers were brutal. I would just start drinking again. Mm -hmm. Like when people say I have a hangover, I would be like, why? Why don't you just drink yourself into the hospital? Spice, <laughs> 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 yeah. spice, spice, spice. Yeah. Uh, that's what me and Tommy Lee were talking about just the other day. It was the yeah. cutest moment ever. Tommy Aww. Lee, rock star of all rock stars, being like, you just drink. They both said it at the same time. They're yeah. Like, oh my God, drink. Like, 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 that's what it is, dude. I know. <laughs> Jinx, let's do heroin. Yeah. <laughs> a little bit of cocaine and a couple of drinks. You're fine. Right. right. <laughs> You're just leveling out. Now we're good. <laughs> Absolutely.